How's it going everybody? ZX9 Green here. I'm going to do a video on um, the 2.4 liter Kia Sorento. I did the transmission change for the very first time ever. Um, right now the vehicle has 98,000 miles on it. I was the very first owner. It's never been changed or anything like that. Kia recommends to do 100,000 miles. So I'm at 98 and I'm almost at 10 years. So it's probably overdue. So I'm going to show you um, how I did it. It was pretty easy. I'm going to get another truck under the vehicle real quick. There wasn't really a YouTube video about this, but um, this big one right here is the drain plug. There's a 29. Oh, sorry, 24 mil millimeter, and it comes off really easy. That was no problem at all. And then the little window—it's well, it's not a window you can't see in it, but that little thing right there is where you pop that off, and it will drain out when you know it's full. Um, I filled it to that same spot because I got a little pump. There was another way to fill it up top, but you had to take a whole bunch of stuff off and it looked. Like it was going to be more work, so I just did this. So check it when it's full right there, and then put it back in. And then, like I said, the drain is right there. And this is a 2011, by the way. And I hadn't really seen a YouTube video with this same setup. And to get to this, you did have to take off a plastic cowling. I'll show you that here in a second. This is the cowling you got to take off right here on the ground. So. That's kind of the most annoying part, getting that out of the way. And I'm going to come over here and show you the results from the oil. Sorry, transmission fluid. First of all, before I forget, I put this in there. It's supposed to be um, to work in the key, and I've seen quite a few other videos where people used it, and they said it worked fine. So, And this is pretty cheap. I think I got it for 16 bucks. I bought it off Walmart.com. Anyway, when I very first changed it, um, I said it had 98,000 on it. And what I was kind of comparing about this, I just changed my Ford F-150 that had 60,000. And it was dirty, but I didn't smell anything burned at all. This one smelled a little old and a little yucky. So this is the um, 98,000. And this, all this down here is what was on the magnet. When you do that drain plug, there's a magnet. Um, there was no chunks or no big pieces, but there was a lot of the metal dust. I took it a while to wipe it off. I'm just going to pour a little bit of this on this so we can see what it looks like on white. So it's pretty dark. You can barely see a little bit of the um, red tint on it if you look hard. And it has kind of a old smell. Not necessarily burned, but old. So I changed it. I got four quarts out, put four quarts in, drove 60 miles because I wanted to get a pretty good flush right away. And so this one right here is after I already changed four quarts, but four quarts in, dro drove the 60 miles. And, um, you know, just looking at it, it's a little bit more red. I'll pour some of that right here too to compare. So you can see it's not a huge difference. There's still a lot of... Um, dirt and stuff in there. I saw one guy on YouTube who did it five, he could did it like five times in a row almost. And he finally got it clear for the fifth time. Uh, but you can see it is better. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to drive it for 2000 miles now. And then at a hundred K I'm going to do it another time. So then I just know at a hundred K I'm good for quite a while, but it was pretty easy. Kind of fun. Um, the one thing that was key for it, for me to use is the uh, this pump. And you can buy it on YouTube. It says Lumax. But with this pump, I could just stick the little thing right in that um, the black hole, the higher one, and just pump it in there so it was easy. But um, And then just a side-by-side. -side. These bottles are kind of crappy, but these are side-by-side. -side. So this is 98, and this is after I changed it. So... 
Anyway, um, maybe I'll do another video when I change it here in 2,000 miles so we can see if the third one, but like I said, the other guy on YouTube, he had to do a change of, uh, he did it like five times in a row. He would do it and then drive like, uh, I don't know, just a little bit, do it again, and, and he finally got it clear looking normal at five. Anyway, I hope that's... Uh, Helped you out a little bit and see how long you should wait or not wait. Uh, just to recommend it after doing a couple, doing my F-150 and doing this. I never towed with this car, it's just the four-cylinder. I'd probably say you'd probably be fine to go 60,000 to 80. Um, like I said, Kia says 100,000. I'm not sure what the time frame was, but like mine was 10 years, 98,000. So it was overdue. Anyway, have a good day. Thanks.